uh, Amanda Bynes. Amanda, Amanda, Amanda Bynes. And we're gonna talk about Amanda Bynes. We just are. We have to. Because I am thoroughly, thoroughly concerned for her. And I'm sure everybody knows the story, but if you don't, uh, basically Amanda Bynes used to be star of the Amanda, the Amanda Show, what was it called, the Amanda Show? Yeah, Amanda, 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 Amanda Show. Back on Nickelodeon. She also was on All That, and then she was in, like, She's the Man or something like that. I, I didn't watch it, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't watch it. I didn't really watch any of her movies. But I know that she was a budding star. And then all of a sudden, she retires from acting and just starts doing weird things and showing up in wigs. Like, like, ugh, I don't understand why I'm wearing this wig, ah. You know, stuff like that. Like, she just starts doing really, really strange things. I should really be wanting to talk, right? But then she starts sending out these tweets saying everybody's ugly, and most recently she said that Barack Obama and Michelle Obama are ugly, and she's dressing like a, a, a I don't know, I don't even know what you call it. Like she's kind of trying to go the hip hop route, but I guess that's kind of the style now because Justin Bieber's doing it, and uh, Miley Cyrus is doing it. So I can't really be like, oh, you're crazy because you're wearing, you know, Jordans. You know, that's that's not that's not crazy. It's a waste of money, but it's not crazy. And so. <clears throat> She's also saying, this is what I want to talk about a little bit, she says she wants to be a rapper and expects a long career as a rapper. Now, the poignant thing here to point out is that Waka Flocka Flame said he's going to sign her to his record label, if you want to call it that. And I just, I, I just don't know what that's going to be like. Like, if she's crazy or not. I'm just really curious. What is Amanda Bynes, the rapper, going to be like? Like, will she be the new 2 Chains? I mean, can she please be the new 2 Chains? Like, I don't want her to try to be like J. Cole or be a conscious rapper or anything like that. I want her to come out here and be as ratchet as possible. Like, I want Amanda Bynes to be out here talking about, like, all that stuff we know she didn't do. Like, I want her to talk about selling bricks. I want her to talk about selling that coke. I want her, I want her, I want her out here crazy. Because you know she didn't do it. You know she didn't sell coke. We saw you grow up. I, I want to see her do it. I mean, because she has nothing else to talk about. I mean, either that she's going to be like, you know, um, Paris Hilton, put out one bad song and it's all over. Uh, there's an anonymous source that says that she's really good at rapping, which I'm like, okay, okay, hey buddy, say what you gotta say, do what you gotta do, but I just want to see this happen, and, and in fact, because I want to see this happen, and I, again, I don't look anything like Amanda Bynes, and I don't have a, a blonde wig or anything of that, of that nature, so I'm doing the best I can here. I made a, re a, a what's what we call it, a recreation or a reenactment, it hasn't happened yet, but what I just think it's gonna be like when she starts rapping, so enjoy. It's Amanda Bonds in the building, you know you feel me, so how your children, you can't do it like me cause you're ugly, uh, look at you, you so ugly, I stay up on Twitter, I know you remember that I'm gonna be here from that day in December, you know me from all that, yes I am all that, I want Drake's right now, uh, give me all blacks. <laughs> yeah, it's me and Amanda Bonds, and you done lost your mind. <laughs> Uh, that's my aunt Liv, y'all. Uh, Amanda Bynes. Amanda Bynes. Amanda Bynes. Amanda Bynes. Amanda Bynes. Amanda Bynes. But really, at the end of the day, I just, I'll be honest, I think she has a mild case of schizophrenia. To be honest with you. I don't even know if mild cases that exist. But that's what I think is going on. What do you guys think is that way Amanda Bynes? She's doing this for attention? Is, is something really wrong there? Because I feel like people that care about her should really be like, hey, hey, we need to help you. Like, 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 like to me, it's like I'm, I'm scared of it like crossing a line where one day, you know, it goes from just being these harmless tweets to something being really, really wrong. And I, I just feel like it's, it's really, really, really bad to not like force her to seek help or force her to do something to help herself before it gets too far. I, I'm not saying that to be facetious, I'm saying that because I really mean it. Like, I really am concerned. Like, I grew up watching her. She's two years younger than me. And it's like, man, it's crazy to see somebody do this kind of stuff. And, like, even, like, she's a beautiful girl. And she keeps saying how, like, she needs her nose is broken and she loves plastic like, surgery. And it's like, no, you were gorgeous before. Just stop, please, no. But you, you can't. You, you just can't do anything because she's an adult, you know? And I just like, I feel like there should be something that can be done and should be done. And I guess that's where I am with this whole thing. Like, I'm in really concerned for a fellow human being and I wanna see her get the help she needs. I know you feel me. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, 
Plastic surgery in the building.